of the growing number of people who suffers from hammer toe, you know it's not only a bit embarrassing, but also very painful. Hammer toe is a deformity of the toe where it buckles and bends, most often the result of constant rubbing against shoes. For that reason, it affects women more often than guys. And for severe cases, there is a surgery that can help. 11 News' Mindy Becerra has tonight's Woman's Doctor. It is very uncomfortable. When you look at Lori Keegan's feet, it's no wonder she's in a lot of pain. She suffers from hammer toe, has for 20 years. I can't do the things I want to do. I, I, you know, I get on the treadmill and I can only be on there for maybe 15 or 20 minutes. and It's just too painful. I can't continue. Um, shoes, what shoes am I going to wear today? You know, If I have to go to work, can I really get by with flip-flop type shoes or sandals? It's, it affects constantly everything I do. The goal of the surgery... Lori is looking forward to October and surgery with Dr. Mark Meyerson. He's the medical director of the Institute of Foot and Ankle Reconstruction at Mercy Medical Center. He says the type of surgery he'll be doing involves an implant and has a much higher success rate than surgeries done in the past using pins. Here's how it works. Imagine this is a hematode deformity. There's a little drill hole that is made in there. The implant is inserted into the toe. We clip it off here, clip it on here remove the clip there and impact it and that's all it is. These are blown up models of the implant made with a 3D printer. This is sensitive to body temperature and as this is inserted it expands and this is the expanded shape and it grips on the toe and cannot move. And that's what holds it all. And that's what holds it together, yes. Dr. Meyerson says patients are able to walk on the foot the next day. But he cautions the recovery is painful. Lori says despite that, she can't wait. I'd like to be able to go back to regular life and regular shoes. Mindy Becerra, WBIL-TV 11 News.